Have you ever heard of slave making ants? These tiny invaders are like the pirates of the insect world, and I am here to pull back the curtain on their wild secret lives. So, here's how it goes down. A queen from a slave making species sneaks into a neighboring ant colony, often with a little squad of her own. They find the nursery, snatch up the helpless ant pupae and haul them back home. When those stolen babies hatch, they're basically tricked into believing they belong and end up working for their kidnappers. It's like nature's version of a heist movie, but with way more legs. But that's not even the wildest part of the ant world. Leafcutter ants, total overachievers. They built sprawling underground cities and we're talking millions of residents. Instead of hunting for food, these ants cut leaves and carry them home, not to eat, but to feed a special fungus they farm underground. The fungus is like their homegrown superfood. Some leafcutter colonies get so huge, you could fit a small car in their tunnels. Imagine over 8 million ants working together in perfect harmony. Teams of workers, soldiers, even ant farmers. Each has a job and every job matters. Next time you see a line of ants on the sidewalk, remember, you might be witnessing the tiniest, most intense drama in nature. Tiny invaders, epic battles and underground cities. Ants are full of surprises. Stay curious.